Father Bless, just a quick question. I hate when I sin, especially self-abuse, but even if I get mad at my sin, I can't seem to use the gift of tears when repenting like the saints talk about. What can I do? Thank you. Look, the problem you have, and all those who are, who are enslaved to the addiction of self-abuse and, and all the various addictions, sexual addictions, the problem is not what you think, usually. I mean, I can't speak of absolutely 100%, but usually the problem is pride, arrogance. Uh, a lack of humility, a lack of obedience, a lack of uh, uh, of striving, um, uh, uh, believing our thoughts, accepting our thoughts, uh, uh, you know, judging our neighbor. So uh, we've got to deal with that, actually. And then we'll what will happen is we'll we'll gather the grace of God, and we'll have then we won't be alone, right? We'll have Christ, and we'll be able to resist. Uh, and and only with Christ and only in Christ, only the grace of God can we overtake overcome these addictions. So you're it's not um, what what's happening is you're you're feeling disgusted about yourself and you're hating the actions and maybe even identifying yourself with the actions and therefore hating yourself. And, but that's all in the realm of regret and it's understandable and it's certainly can be and should be some protection against repeating the, 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 you know, going back to the vomit again and again, but that's not, it's not really there is where the healing needs to take place. Uh, it needs to take place before you get to the temptation, right? And the, and, and, and you need to be built up in the grace of God so that you can resist the temptation. Uh, and so, you know, humbling yourself in every single way possible will enable you to gain, gain the grace of God. So you've got a prayer rule, keep it. You've got the fasting on Wednesday and Friday. Keep it right. That's a that's that's a stance of humility. It's a stance of submission to Christ. Don't stand and you know uh, in an arrogant way before your husband, wife, mother, father, whoever you know, whoever we're talking to, whatever it is. Don't don't belittle other people. Don't judge other people. Uh, take seriously the spiritual regiment. All these things are ways of submitting ourselves and humbling ourselves. And, and I think that's usually the missing, missing, uh, you know, segment of this whole puzzle of how to overcome these addictions. Uh, and of course you have to pray fervently and here's the prayer, Lord, give me hatred of sin. Give me hatred of this passion. Uh, give me fear of thee. Uh, help me remember death. All these things to stand and walk and remember uh, a, a death and to hate the sin. Um, that's the key, right? That's the key. I'm still